Hi, I'm Marie from Crochet A to Z, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please push that subscribe button. And if you have, thank you for doing so. And please, if you've watched my video tutorials and you do like them, please push the like button. So we're going to start today with the lemon peel stitch. And here it is right here. It's a real pretty stitch, lightly textured, and easy, easy, easy to do. And you can make many things with this. You can make afghans, cowls, face, face cloths, hot pads, and many, many other things with this particular stitch. And I'm going to show you just how easy it is to make. Now, what you have to remember when you do this is you have to do multiples of two. So two plus two plus two until you get to your desired length. And then after that, you add a one. So I'm going to show you how to do this and how great it is and how easy it is to make. Now, for the sake of this tutorial, I did 15 chains. And this is your working chain. These are your chains, which are the hook, the, is the Vs. Again, whatever's on your chain, uh, whatever chain is on your hook is your working chain. And at the end, this is your slip knot. And there are video tutorials to show you all the stitches and exactly how to get there on my channel. So what we're going to do today is we're going to chain into the second chain from the hook. We're going to go to the second chain from the hook. Not this one, but this one. There's your working chain. One, two. And we're going to do a single crochet in that chain. Now we're going to do a double crochet. Now we're going to do a single crochet. A double. A single. A double. We're going to be doing this right across a single till we get to the end. Now it's going to curl up a little bit. A double. So see where you are? You're going to go into the next one over. This is your double. You're going to do a single. You're going to do a double. You're going to do a single. You're going to do another double. You're going to do a single. And then your last chain you're going to do right in there a double crochet. Now what you're going to do is you're going to chain one and you do this every time you do this and this is a one row repeat over and over and over again so you're going to turn your work around and in this first chain you're going to do your single crochet right where you chained one and now you're going to do a double crochet and you're going to keep doing a single and a double until you get to the end. So that was your double. I'm going to just pull this so it comes off easy. Here's your single. This is your double. And you didn't even, you, you, you know exactly what, where you're going in. So it's really easy to tell where you're going. 
your double. Single, your double, and your single, your double, your single, and your double. Now don't miss this, don't miss this. You're always going to end in a double crochet. Now see that, that texture? That's why they call it the lemon peel because it has a lemon peel texture to it. Now you will repeat, you're going to chain one, you're going to turn this around you're going to go into that very first stitch and you're going to do a single crochet. Now, right in there, you're going to do a double crochet. And you're always going to know that if you did it wrong, you're going to be able to tell by the look and the texture. So this is a single, a double, a single, a double, a single, a double, and your finger's going to bring you right where you need to go. It's not like you're not going to know. It's, it's right there. This is one of the easiest stitches there is. You could even make, and I'm going to be making, a nice... Um, case for um, an iPad that I have. So there's your single, your double, your single, and your double. Always end with a double because you're gonna be doing the opposite. See how it has that lemon? So when you touch it, it almost has that lemon peel texture to it. You're gonna chain one, you're gonna turn your work around, and in this very first stitch where you did your double, you're going to do a single crochet. Now you're going to do a double crochet a single, a double, a single, a double. And it's a really, it is a really pretty stitch. You can make it in any color you want. Um, you can make it in cotton. This is acrylic yarn. So there, a double crochet, a single, a double, and it does have the feel of, of a, um, of a lemon peel, the outside of a lemon peel, your single, and then once again, your last stitch is a double crochet. And I want to let you know that the front and the back of this is the same. And you always end again in that double crochet because you chain one right here you always end in that double crochet because what happens is you always chain one here and 
okay? Then you turn it around and you always make a single crochet in your first stitch when you turn it around. So here's your single crochet, here's your chain one. And when you turn it around, here's your single crochet goes in that very first stitch. You start with the single, you end with the double, you turn it around, you always start with the single. This is a repeat pattern. Now you're going to do your double crochet again, and you're going to continue this pattern throughout whatever it is you're making. You're going to get to the end, you're going to do a double crochet right here, you're going to turn it around, you're going to do your single crochet. Once you do your chain one, you're always going to do a single crochet here. So this is the lemon peel stitch and it's really pretty. It goes quickly and it works up really nice. It is a lightly textured pattern and you can make a lot of things with it. So I wanted to show you this quick and easy tutorial. I hope you enjoyed the lemon peel stitch. It's a really nice stitch to make. Thank you from Crochet A to Z. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and please like my tutorials if you do like them. And I want to thank you and again subscribe and have a great day. Thanks. Bye-bye.